From the heart of Philly, this is CBS News Philadelphia. Now at 5 o'clock, trouble on 202. What's become a familiar sight returns, causing a huge headache for people just trying to get home to work or visit a business. Pendant says it's not a sinkhole or a pothole. Instead, crews blame soft soil for a dip in the road. Good evening. I'm Yuki Washington. I'm Jessica Cartelia. Whatever it is, mm -hmm. it's causing a tremendous traffic headache. This is the part of Route 202 northbound that we are talking about. DeKalb Pike between Henderson Road and Solon Boulevard in Upper Marion Township. Pendant crews have the left lanes blocked so that they can make repairs. Let's bring in CBS Philadelphia reporter Ray Strickland with the problem that seems to keep happening over and over again. Ray? Well, here's some good news, Yuki. The work here along Route 202 was expected to last until uh, early next week. That was the timeline that we were given, the rough timeline that we were given by PennDOT uh, when it thought it was fixing a sinkhole. Now, I did say good news because now that we know that it's just soft soil that was causing this, you know, what you would call a depression on the road, things are now going to be uh, wrapped up quicker than we expected. As you can see, the hole that they dug in the ground is already filled and they already started started repaving. It is frustrating when it happens. More repair work along Route 202 in King of Prussia after PennDOT suspected a sinkhole was causing a dip in the road. Now officials believe it was soft soil. We've just kind of gotten used to it. But sinkholes in the area remain a big concern for many. There's been two in the past year. The latest was back in December. It's scary. Yeah, yeah but I'm afraid I'm going to drive over it and the earth's going to open up <laughs> and I'm going to fall in. So that's not a good feeling. Both incidents shut down Route 202 near Henderson Road, not only impacting drivers, but also businesses. Lisa Cristenzio is the assistant manager of Marianne's Attic. It is kind of frustrating, but I mean, they're doing the best that they can to try to fix it every time. Roseanne Baer is a geologist with the Pennsylvania Geological Survey. She says the rocks beneath Route 202 are limestone, which is susceptible to dissolution, making the road more prone to sinkholes. The material starts to move out, um, whether it's heavy rainfall or a broken storm sewer, broken water main. Those will flush out some of those cavities and, and sort of take away that support. Robin Briggs with PennDOT says addressing the sinkhole issue is a big priority with the permanent fix scheduled for July. This permanent project, though, they're going to be able to scope out the whole area, uh, get down there, get really deep down there, and see what's, uh, what other situations that they're finding. Right. And that permanent fix is a part of a, pro a project, I should say, that's going to be federally funded, costing around $20 million. Yuki, Jess. Great. Thank you so much.